guys, my name is Heike, and I am here to do a video about what's in my bag. Um, I've done a few videos before, but I'd rather not show what it is because it's embarrassing. I'm no, I'm kidding. <laughs> so, um, this is my purse. This is the Givenchy Antigona tote in the lot one if you will. As you can see, the Givenchy and that's Jose. I, I kind of named him Jose because I had a Rottweiler rat when I was growing up and his name was Jose Cuervo. Obviously I named my pets after my uncle Bob. So yeah, so as you can see it's a pretty huge bag. This is my work bag. And so we're going to be in for a lot of things underneath this thing. Okay, let's start with, uh, my purse comes with this. So it comes with the tote itself because it's huge. So in a way you, um, you need to have this attached because the purse doesn't have any pocket or anything. This comes attached to um, this. So in a way, you know, you don't want to lose your purse, I mean, your keys or your cards or whatever. So let me show you what I have in this first. Uh, I have, oh, look, I got my Zhu and Xi uh, card. I just got this, I just got the purse recently for my birthday, which is a couple of weeks ago. It was my birthday gift to myself. So I have that. I have some cash. <laughs> I actually don't have a wallet, <laughs> so that's why I have like just a bunch of cash like laying around. Um, I have my little ball. It's the um, manifesto from Yves Saint Laurent. It's pretty amazing. It's good for daytime, and whenever I feel like I need a pick me up, I just have this. Um, I also have. Oh, what do you do? You still around? It's a lip balm, and it's. I don't even know what it is, but it's sheer. It's a lip balm, and it doesn't. I I can't really wear lipstick all that much because I I eat a lot or I always have something in my mouth that sounded dirty but no I just like I'm, I'm eating I'm talking and I'm like so I'm better off with lip balm um trick is if it's in silver it's a lip balm if it's in gold it's a lipstick so I have that and then oof, what do I have oh a bunch of like coins and stuff but I do have my card case see I told you I don't carry a wallet I just have a card case I carry all my credit cards and my debit card and even my laundry card for fuck's sakes it's shit like that all in there yeah and this is from Chanel and it comes in blush pink and I love it and it matches my nails and my pajamas <laughs> Sorry, I just got girly over there. Anyway, so I think that's all inside this thing. And what's next? Okay, so this is the biggest thing that I have in my purse. I told you my purse was big, so I did have big things in there as well. Um, I have... Okay, I'm a huge fan of Smashbox, just because... Um, it's a good quality makeup, but I do not have to go to Sephora for it. You know, I can go to a boutique, uh, Shopper Smart, which is kind of a, um, how do you say, a drugstore, but it's high end, you know, so I just go there. So this is the Smashbox. Full exposure palette, and um, it's full of nudes. 
where you can see which ones I take out of. <laughs> it's just like the browns and stuff. I'm very tanned. Not very, but more tanned than others. And um, I like my browns. I also have the Naked um, Urban Decay Flushed, which is a highlighter, a blush, and a, and a bronzer in one. I like this one. I also have the Smudgebox. Um, this is like the having a medium is a little darker. It's Halo is the most amazing thing ever. And I use it with this brush. I just got it from the Makeup Forever. I forgot which number. I'm sorry, I forgot. Oh, 124 is right there. <laughs> so it's like a kabuki brush, but it's the most amazing thing ever. It feels so good and so soft. So these two go together. I know this is a little bit pricier, like it's 70 bucks just to get this one, but this one lasts me a long time, like a long, long time, maybe like three, four months. I mean, that's worth it, right? Anyway, and then what else do I have here? Well, obviously I have the Liquid Halo. I like that one as well. I use um, seven. And um, of course I use also use Smashbox, the primer, oh my god, has anyone of you tried this? It's pretty fucking awesome, like, it makes your skin so velvety soft, like, anyway, I've had this on a sample, and I'm like, okay, I'm sold, so I got, and this lasts forever as well, like, at least two months, I've had this, and I wear makeup every day, obviously. <laughs> So there's that, and oh, I have um, Make It Forever, it's a two-way brush, it's one of my first purchases from brushes uh, for Make It Forever, and it's been really good. This I use this for blush, I use this for bronzer, and it's a, it's, it, I mean it costs 40 bucks, and it's a really good purchase. So yeah, whenever you get a chance, have this. And then I have Mary Luminizer. You can only get this from the States. I'm from Canada, obviously. So um, I don't get this anywhere. But um, I really like this. And I actually have a brush for this. I haven't shown you yet where it is because it's on another bag. <laughs> but this is the most amazing highlighter ever. So if you ever have this, um, in your town, please get it because I will hate you if you don't because I can't have it like, like this is all like okay, let me show you this is all like oh god See it's all like yeah, I dropped it one time. I'm like, oh my god. No, so but I just tried to save it because this is just so amazing Anyway, let me put that delicately over there and I have Kiyomura of Lash Curler. I'm Asian. I don't have a lot of lash. I don't know if this is the best thing because, yeah, maybe I need to look out for a better, like, pair or whatever. So, so if you have any suggestions, you should tell me. Um, I don't have anything else in there. Like a, like a brush or something. No. Nothing in there anymore. So. Oh, by the way, this is a Louis Vuitton. It's a toiletry case. And I have it in the biggest um, size. And they have it in smaller ones. But I thought it would be a perfect um, makeup case. It's a toiletry case, but I thought it would be the it would be best as a makeup case. But I do have a smaller one, so just you wait. <laughs> Obviously, um, I had some drinks when I purchased these. 
So this is the smaller one, and I try to. Um, I'm sure everyone is familiar with it. It's kind of supposedly a case for. Uh, it's like a, ma a cosmetic case. Sorry, of my English is not so good today. Sorry, but it's a cosmetic case. It's not the biggest one, but it's. I think it's the second two biggest. And I got it because I wanted a case for my brushes. And so I will show you. Obviously, I do not have brushes in here, or not much. Um, I have false lashes. <laughs> um, I have concealer from Smashbox, obviously. I have lash glue. comes with... I like this because it kind of looks like eyeliner when you put them on. I'm, I haven't perfected it yet because I'm just horrible at it, like putting on false lashes. And I usually put like half these, you know, like the ones that look so natural, just half of your eye. But I'm still not good at it, like I'm horrible. Anyway, um, let's see what I have here. Obviously brushes, but I'm... I'm gonna try not to bore you, but these are the lashes. I mean, sorry, these are um, the mascara. Oof. Holy shit! Okay, those are the mas that's the mascara that I use. It's Clinique, and I don't know if you can see. Yeah, I found this one because I realized I used to have. Um, lash extensions and um, I realized that I was allergic to latex so over time my eyes got really swollen and I thought you know what I it's not worth it I know I want like nice long lashes but I'm Asian I should just at least accept that I do not have that and these are lifesavers they're hypoallergenic and they make your lashes look so long, it's unbelievable. And I I have nothing. Like, my lower lashes are as long as my upper lashes. So it's, it's yeah, anyway, <laughs> I don't want to try to sell this out too much, but it's called Clinique High Length Mascara. So it's the white one with the silver thing. And I have this just to come out the lashes and this is just to come out just to come out the brows this is from makeup forever um, oh, 276 if you're looking for one number is 276 and then I have this for my foundation this is from makeup forever it's a uh, brush 108. It's really, really good. It's very basic. Like, um, it's not fancy at all. Um, but you just have to clean it every week. I find, I mean, it works fine, but I find that it works perfect when you've cleaned it. You know, it's you, the best feeling in the world is that when you've had like really nice. Uh, clean brushes and you're like oh, yes <laughs> so that's 108 straight for makeup forever and this is the one that I use for my highlighter is makeup forever number 144 in wavy and you just like pat it up your brows with a highlighter and it works like magic. And then what else do I have in here? I have a few things that are just I don't know. Oh, okay. This is um from the palette that I had from Smashbox. Okay. This one. It comes with this. So this is this is for the matte side. 
hopefully you can see the brushes are so nice and then this is for the shimmer side see Smashbox is very underrated when it comes to the quality of their brushes. It's actually really, really good, and it compares to Bobbi Brown, and it compares to uh, Makeup Forever and MAC. It's actually pretty good. And this comes with a palette, so I got this on a steal. Um, speaking of Bobbi Brown, I have this. It's um, it's an ultra fine eyeliner. I don't really use this, but because I'm not really good at um, eye makeup altogether. But if you are and you want something that's very precise, you might want to get one of these. And I got this with this. This is. Long wear gel eyeliner. <laughs> it's um, chocolate shimmer ink number thirteen. Actually, yeah, I remember this now. I haven't used it very much. Like I said, I'm not very good with my eye makeup. I'm I tend to get lazy. So um yeah, but this is very festive and very nice. It's actually subtle. It it it's supposed to be shimmery, but it's very subtle. Um, I can't provide you with a very accurate review on that because I have not used it all that much. I want to spend a lot of money for it. Anyway, so what else do I have here? I have Benefit. Oh, I love Benefit. Here we go. I have Benefit. It's like a brow, um, instant brow pencil. So you have this. To draw on your brows and you have this to brush. I thought it was pretty simple and nice for a simple folk like me. And this is Ulo Lift. Come on guys, who has not had this? Okay, it's it's kind of like ratchet right now, but this is a lifesaver. Like for me, I am dark. And I always have dark like dark under bags, and it's not pretty at all. This has been a lifesaver. Um, it it just reflects light off your face. You put it under your eyes, or you and you put it on your T zone, and under just on your chin, and you get the light reflecting off you. And I don't know, maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just being psychotic, but. Like most girls, I think it works. But try it out. And it's not that expensive. Um, what else do I have? I have a few Sephora brushes. Oh, yeah. I use this to, like, just for coverage, like, um, you know, the white stuff you put before you put dark stuff on your eyelids. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not making sense. Anyway, that stuff. Okay, so this is Bobbi Brown. It's a brush. Um, I actually got it from a palette that I do not use because I thought it was a little too light for me. I'm a little dark skin, like I'm olive skin, as you can see. And um, um, so I got this nude palette um, from Bobbi Brown and it came with this brush. And the best part of that palette is this brush. So I use this, this, oh, it's so nice. So this brush is actually very, very soft, and you can use it to blend. And for me, I use it to, because um, it's a little smaller, so I use it to put my darker shadow. And this one I, I use for my darkest shadow. See how it works out? Yeah, this is an amazing brush. I wish Bob Bobby Brown would um, make this like in full production, even without the palette. It's actually pretty nice. And what else do I have? Oh, another Clinique. Uh, what did I tell you? 
I like the meat because it's hypoallergenic and I'm allergic to a lot of things. So this brown, it's uh, the color is chocolate luster. And another Clinique. Black Diamond 101. Yeah, I love those things. They're like crayons, but for your eyes. And then I have oh, Laura Mercier. It's it's just like a pink um, lipstick. It's not it's nothing special. I have I don't, no way I still have this. <laughs> like I haven't used this in so long. And this is I just purchased this and I really like it. But except I wish it had a little bit more pigment. It's Dior in um, Extreme 356 Cherry Bell. Anyway, um, it's pretty nice, except um, I don't wear a lot of lipstick, so I need something to pop. And um, this doesn't really do it for me. Maybe I need to rethink my choices with lipstick. Anyway, so <laughs> this is taking so long. I have a lot of stuff in there. Oh, so in my purse, I forgot what we were doing. But yeah, in my purse, I have Yves Saint Laurent for Women's and Lesbians. It's pretty nice. Pretty modern. And it's in there. And an umbrella. Oops, sorry. Um, I I actually just lost my Burberry umbrella, and it was given to me by a friend, and I lost it in a restaurant. I came back for it, and they swore they haven't seen it, so I'm pretty sure they stole it from me. <laughs> anyway, um, I have some, um, what do you call it, sanitizer, some brush, hairbrush, Kleenex, um, what do I have, wet wipes, I love wet wipes, I'm obsessed with wet wipes. Um, and I have, oh, I, I, um, I usually carry this just to separate my cash from everything else. Um, it's from Salvatore Ferragamo. And it has clean it up, it has a little mark, and a little bit. Uh, yeah, so this is where I usually keep my cash. Because, like I said, I don't carry a wallet. I carry a card case. Not exactly a wallet. So I'll wear a, I, sorry, I wear this and I put my cash in it and then I wear and I carry this very good pair right here and yeah that's all I need to wear and they all come yeah uh -huh. oh, sorry um <laughs> I still have like a Chanel there. Chanel? No, 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 no. But yeah. And that's all I have. In my little, not so little, Givenchy purse. I love it. Alright, thanks for watching. This is my very first video, and I just wanted to share my. <laughs> I'll see you next time.